Yeah. You ready, guy? I'm all ready. We're finally gonna get this stupid car. Long story short, we're running into some issues. This is the old wheel I had on my car, and uh, I asked the mechanic here, I asked him to fill it up before I got here, and he didn't. So I had to go buy a freaking compressor I could plug into the truck. Also, we gotta, we gotta uh, jump the thing. If I don't get this car today, I'm gonna punch a hole through this window. All right, so we finally jerry-rigged it and got her going. Now we just gotta crank her on. Okay, so after like half hour, we got it on. It is like 100 degrees out right now. I feel like I just got out of a pool. But the things you gotta do for your cars, right? Got it on, pulled it on by hand. Four different times, had to come along, strap it. We got it on, I'm getting my truck, kicking the AC on, let's do this. Well, we're finally dropping off the trailer. Jay doesn't wanna be in the video, but too bad. It only took us hmm, six hours to take the tri the car, what, 30 minutes away? So that was fun. All right, guys, so we got the car on the trailer, and I, we drove it up there, and I totally forgot to record pretty much everything else home. We got it up to my cousins, and <laughs> Jalen, we picked Jalen up, and me and Marty undid all the straps. And I forgot to tell her about the brakes because there's only one caliper that holds the dang car and the back two brakes don't work and I took one of the right ones off because the other one on my show was seized. So I took one off and it's only got one caliper that's slowing the car down. Well, we're like, all right, Jalen, put it in neutral and then we'll tell you where to go. And the minute she put it in neutral, it just went soaring off the off the trailer. Thank the Lord I had the, uh, I had the ramps in the, in the spots they were supposed to be. Uh, it was pretty funny and then we just pushed it Kept it there and uh, cousin said beginning of August we should be able to start dropping the cradle, dropping the front end. Um, so here's what I got for the car. Like I said, it was nothing special, but let me move my clothes. In one of the uh, Ford Taurus SHO, the V8 forever, uh, it's a V8, the V8 show page on Facebook, somebody was selling their transmission AX4 on overhaul kit. Um, so, because places will rip you off for these parts, he sold this to me for 200 bucks. Uh, I got all the gaskets, seals, um, I got clutches, uh, clutches and steels, all four of them, all four sets, um, pan gaskets, stuff like that. Got this for 200 bucks, so it saved me a lot of money in the long run. Uh, the next thing is just finding some place. I, I checked some place that went to before, and they totally ripped me off. Uh, for pricing and stuff like that, so I'm not going to that place anymore. I was recommended to someone else I'm gonna check them out see what they would do it for because all I'm doing is giving them the transmission and this kit and telling them Hey put this in there If it needs anything else give it give it what it needs Let me know put it back together and then I'll put it back in the car So yeah, that's the plan as of now it is the parts car is finally up in my cousins We can start stripping it of what I need and I got the overhaul kit and we should be good to go. So now that that's all taken care of, my truck brakes are starting to squeak and I just wanna check them before they start grinding because I don't wanna get new rotors too, I just wanna get new pads. I'd rather spend the money on the car than the truck and if I get new rotors, I wanna go all out. This truck, when I get new parts for it, I wanna go all out. So I'm gonna get a good decent set of pads but I don't wanna get new rotors right now. So I'm gonna check them, see how bad they are, if they're bad enough. I'm just gonna order some new pads. So, first of all, it's almost hotter than it was yesterday, which thankfully it rained, but you know. Um, so now I'm sitting in the sun here, but anyway. My front, I could have swore it came from the front, and as you might be able to see there if it focuses, I got a lot of brake pad left. Tons of it, both sides are like that. Um, I don't know, it, it, it squeaks a lot though, like not every time I hit the brakes, but 90 percent uh, maybe like 75 percent of the time i hit the brakes it squeals so i'm gonna go ahead and check the back because i mean i guess it could be the back 
sure sound like it's coming from the front, but I'm gonna go to check it and we'll go from there. All right, so I pulled it in. Now I'm gonna check on the back. All right, yep, this side's even better, which obviously I know like the back doesn't use um, the brakes as much as the front as the front does, but I didn't know if maybe they changed the front on this thing and maybe in all of its six years of living, this thing's never been changed in the back, so maybe it's why they're bad back here, but no, they are perfectly fine back here, so I guess uh, I'm just gonna leave it and listen to the squeak for thousands more miles all right guys so I gotta say thank you for watching hope you enjoyed it was a good update for you um, so like I said beginning or beginning of August is when my cousin said he should be able to start working on the car so um, and I can be able to get up there so we're gonna drop the tranny and put that overhaul kit in that I just showed you or we're, I'm gonna send it in get that overhaul kit put on and uh, in the meanwhile start rebuilding the motor and get working on it once the trans blows in this thing, it's uh, it's gonna be out of commission until it's probably pretty much fully redone. Um, so probably won't be driving this thing too much longer, but videos on it will be being posted. And uh, I'll always be doing work on the truck and stuff like that and taking both of them to meets if I can, otherwise taking the truck to the meets and just having fun and doing other things with my friends. Um, hopefully, Marty 76 I'm gonna start putting on the channel too because uh, he's gonna start restoring that and maybe we can start maybe I can record some of that I think we're gonna take the box off tomorrow and uh, do some other things like that but hope you guys enjoyed if you did hit the like button hit the subscribe button I'll see you in the next vlog